Hola, me llamo Laura. Hello, my name is Laura. Welcome back. Today I will be talking about my name and I'm going to give you some tips on how to pronounce it in Spanish. But first, let's take a look at how this awesome name is pronounced in different languages. Bonjour à tous. Je suis français, je m'appelle Jérôme. Et je tiens à vous dire que le prénom de ma youtubeuse préférée en français se prononce Laura. Laura. In my accent, Laura. <laughs> Laura. 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 I think it's amazing how a name can be pronounced completely different in other languages. Let me tell you a really short story. When I was 10, I came to the United States and I didn't know any English. When people used to ask me for my name, I would say, my name is Laura, and they would be a bit confused because they had never heard of the name before. Over the years, I learned how to say my name as Laura, and it was a bit hard for me because the R in English is different from the R in Spanish. But over the years I learned and since then I have been introducing my name either as Laura or Laura depending on the environment. I think my story can be related to immigration a century or two back, and specifically in the United States where people used to come from different countries and actually have to change their name just so that other people would be able to pronounce their name. And I think in a way this kind of took away part of their identity because in different cases the final name was completely different from their original name. In my case, I feel like Laura is fine for people to pronounce. However, I do encourage people to pronounce my name in Spanish as Laura, just because I think it's beautiful and because I think that was my original name. So I feel like part of that is my identity. With that said, I don't mind if people pronounce it in other languages. And I think it's super pretty in other languages. And I actually like hearing it. Um, from foreigners. Okay, so if you're interested in learning to say Laura in Spanish, let me give you two tips. Number one, listen, Laura, Laura. How many syllables is that? That's two syllables, right? If you use three syllables instead, so like if you say Laura, it's a bit different and if you say la hora, it actually sounds like la hora, which is the time. So if you're saying la hora, I'm gonna be like, what, you want the time or something? So definitely say la together and put the emphasis on the la. So la hora. Don't say la hora. Put the emphasis on the la. La hora. The second tip would be how to pronounce the R. Listen, la hora. Look at my mouth. Laura. So the tip that I usually give people is to think of the word louder. So like loud but louder. So say that word for first. Louder, louder, louder. That D sound it's similar to the R sound in Laura. So if you go from louder to Laura, it's a bit easier. So listen. Louder, louder, Laura. Laura. Get it? Well, I hope these tips were a bit helpful for you in pronouncing Laura in Spanish. To end this video, I want to show you a couple of people pronouncing Laura in Spanish and let me know if you can spot the native Spanish speakers. All right, let's take a look and I'll see you next time. Laura. 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 Laura.